Division 5 now and all top four seeds won last week in Region 16, including the Coldwater Caval Cavaliers, giving the two-time defending state champs their 10th straight season with at least 10 wins. Wow, that's impressive. Cavs reward top seeded here on a rematch of last year's regional final, of course, won by Coldwater en route to the state title. And just two weeks ago, these two schools met in the volleyball regional finals with the Tigers getting the victory. Up to tip and we go. Coldwater leading 7-0 in the first quarter. Brody Hoyne on the keeper to the far side. He's brought down and shaken up on the play. Ankle giving him some problems. He limps to the sidelines and would remain out for a little. So Jack Hemmelgarn in at quarterback. Swing pass to Chris Post. Completion is good for about seven yards. Then the inside handoff to Post. Wrapped up in the backfield. Coldwater is forced to punt. Here on on offense now, Kyle Kovac out of the gun, rolls out to his left. He's going to keep it, gets to the edge, knocked out of bounds by Jack Schmidt. So it's third down now for the Tigers. Kovac looking over the middle. Go check out this defense. Well defended by Chris Post. He almost comes away with the pick here on forced to punt. So the Cavs offense on the field. Hemelgarn, his pass is deflected at the line of scrimmage and picked off by Nick Spursina. Turnover gives the Tigers great field position. Move to the second quarter. Kovac swings it to Tommy Bogdan, and he's into the end zone for a touchdown. That ties the game at seven. So Coldwater looking to regain the lead. Hemelgarn pitches to post. To the outside, he fumbles, but alert play by Aaron Harlemer. He's there to fall on it and keep possession for the Cavs. Then the jet sweep goes to Craig Shanehair. He burrows his way to the 45-yard line. Same drive, Hemelgarn, pump fake. Goes deep to Derek Toby. Fantastic catch on the sideline for the senior. He's out of bounds at the 13-yard line. So Hemelgarn going to go back to the air. Moving to his right. Hits Harlemert. Knocked out of bounds inside the five. So then Brody Hoyne got that ankle taped up. Comes into the game here and runs, dives, and he's into the end zone. What a play. Coldwater goes up 14-7, and they win it. From there, 40 to 14, the final over here on.